Hi, and welcome to Jim's Train Tips. Today we're going to explore all the various places where you can set a train set up and keep it out of everybody's way as well. On the lounge room floor or on the kitchen table usually wears pretty thin with the rest of the household fairly fast so you need somewhere to keep it and out of everyone's way. A few possibilities, spare room, attic, basement, garage, fold up tables, a board or even in a suitcase if you're only modelling something like Z-scale. We'll get into construction details for boards and modules in episode 4. Now if your spare room's anything like ours, it's going to be pretty packed full of other stuff, so that usually rules it out. And I don't think I'd be allowed up here at any rate, seeing it seems to be full of couches and chairs and things. If you belong to a club, you, know, you might be able to get hold of an old railway coach, they're always good. An old station building if you're really lucky, or even put up a purpose-built building. Common way to go is the single car garage, like this one that was on our block. This is the one I use for my train set. But before we could do too much with the trains department, we had to put some lining in this shed, uh, wired it up for lights and power, and uh, we're still continuing with the painting, and we've got to get into lining the doors, and as you can see, to keep all the creepy crawlies out. In the next episode we'll check through some plans that might suit the space that you've got and look at all the possibilities. See you then.